Shit. Last time on or last time on dead ass. You could change some things up. I mean, I would change the order up. People come to see open mic, get them out the way. First what? Get them out the way. Get them out the way. Get it, get Because everybody was like real hype after your show, a little surprisingly. Everyone was like. Surprisingly. So I'm just giving advice. Advice. He said advice. He what? did say advice. So Mike Eagle comes to a new city with a new project, opens up, and then the local artist performs in like the middle of the set, and then I kind of put everybody to sleep and everybody rolls out. That's your ideal rap show. That sounds like, can we try it like that tonight? You know, it doesn't feel like the best vibe suddenly. Who doesn't like bedtime stories? Okay. I'm open Mike Eagle, dead ass on an independent rap tour. So typically, as a rapper, I also have to wear other hats. I can't afford to pay a tour manager, for instance, so I manage my own tours. I'm my own driver, I tend to handle my own merch. This tour is a little bit different. Got always prolific with me, helping me out on stage. And uh, since I'm headlining, and I don't usually do that, we actually are traveling with an opening act as well, which on this leg of the tour is uh, Sam. It's not all glory, it's not all glamour, it's not all beautiful green rooms and big nice hotel suites. It's very little of those things actually. It's a lot of us uh, doing more than one job. We try to keep, keep the cost low, because we out here. Dead ass. My whole aim for the tour is to take less stress off of bro so he can focus and you know tear the house down. I'll handle gear, wires. We never forget anything. I don't forget anything. And I mean that. Sam is on tour killing it. Sis is doing an awesome job. Wait, she's doing a prolific job. So you know, we just out here, you know? So get at me. That's it? That's, that's it. That's all everything you want to say. You yeah. didn't, didn't forget anything. I don't think, you know. You say that and forget me. That's that's. that's, that's All right, I'll, I'll set it up. Okay, okay. I'll, I'll set it up. I'll set it up. Don't you worry. That's, that's good. That was good, man. That was real good. Thank you. Real good. Thanks. Hey, I'm Samus, and I'm on an independent rap tour. Um, and like Mike and Pro were saying, at this level, you know, there's a lot of kind of self-management, um, and I really consider my role as an opener to just draw people to the stage and really like get the energy hyped up for folks to come and share stuff. And it's been an honor and a pleasure um, seeing Pro and Mike every night just kill it. So I'm just, yeah, I'm really happy to be here. Okay, love it. Love it. That's, that's, it. that's it, yeah. That's it? Yeah. You too? Yes. That's it. You know what, I'll, I'll do my own. I'm Video Dave, and I'm on an independent rap tour. Yeah, I'm on the tour too. Doing video projections, making a TV show, um, doing some driving, doing some talking, like keep, you know, like do you do this on purpose? This is what we, this is what this we all talking about. You talking about what's going on, and you're out here. You talk about Sam is doing a good job, pro. Everybody's talking about each other. Nobody mentions Video Dave. Like I'm not even out here. People think I'm just out here taking up space and shit. Um, I wasn't trying to ignore you or nothing, but uh. Um, I've been meaning to bring up something to you Use about right one of the jobs you're doing out here, your, uh, your video projection. I mean, I don't know, this is kind of a sensitive conversation. Maybe you want to turn the cameras off. I mean, this might be We're making a show, this is real, let's go. So, Damn. you know, even if it gets a little sensitive, you're gonna be good with it being on camera? Like, it's real, reality, I'm real. All right, man, well look, you're doing video projections every day. And, um, you know, like, I have to trust that whatever's going on behind me that's getting projected on the wall is like dope. And you say, it's dope. You see, that's what you say, right? You say you've been doing like a really good job and yeah. I trust that, right? But I can't see while I'm up there rapping. Cause I've seen a couple photos of like what's going on behind me and it's not tight. Like the stuff I'm seeing is not tight. What? I don't know, uh, man. Like I, I, said, haven't seen, I haven't seen that one photo. What are you talking about? I, well, I mean, there's one that I got from somebody who did a review of the show. 
yo, don't come at me because you're getting bad reviews for your show. No, I got a great review for the show. The photo, however, that they used to go with this article was a photo of me performing with what looks like the back end of the software nope. that you're using, like no. projected no. onto my face no. and behind me. No, let me see. Man. Obviously, that was like during sound check. Like, so you let you let the journalists in during sound check. You let them in early, and then the are taking pictures. Oh, okay, so you saw and I'm, I'm I got to take the fall for this. You saw people taking pictures during sound check. Well, I didn't see it. I was busy doing my job. Possibly that one was sound check. Okay, but I got another one from a show, and clearly it's a show because there's people in front of me in the foreground. And what's going on behind me? Blank white screen, Dave. What's so tight about a blank white screen? I could have did that without you. We don't need light coming from a projector to make the white you thing know, wider behind me. It's moving at the speed of light. People can't even see that. When a picture stops and takes a still image that's different from what people see. Do you, you don't understand the difference between eyes and cameras. I mean, so are people's cameras broken or their eyeballs broken? Are you doing something so advanced it's beyond like human comprehension? It's pretty advanced and it's moving a little bit faster than that person. Their shutter speed is slow, I can tell. The shutter speed on their phone. It's not like they're adjusting ISO. They're just taking a picture of what they're seeing. It's probably not an iPhone. Does that make a difference? Listen, man, I'm out there doing good work. This don't look like Show good work. Show me something else. Oh my God. Are you, are you on Facebook during the show? Are you man, kidding me? That's. My sister, it was like an emergency message. I just, it was an a few seconds. An emergency message? You checking your messages on Facebook and projecting it behind me during my show? That was just you think this is excellent work? One picture I'm getting set up over here by Sarah. Well, this is three so far. And what is this one? What? What? Is, is this Christian Mingle? Why are you even on Christian Mingle? I'm looking for a good girl. I just wanted... And you felt like all of this was a good idea to project during the show, Dave. Well, we only have one night in town. I'm Internet working. dating during my show I'm is not you doing out. a good job. <laughs> just... What? So, you... Okay, Dave. You don't want me to be having a good time? I don't want you to be looking at porn during my set, Dave. Like, I really... I don't even know how to feel about that. Like, I don't know why you think this is a good idea. Like, do you know that porn is like the most popular? Like, that's how technology is always advances through porn. And whatever you see in porn is what's coming. Like, the biggest technological advances are coming next. I think you. You know, I think I'm learning that you're a terrible person. And I didn't know that before right now, but it's becoming very clear to me that you just might be an awful guy. Oh yeah, yeah, two I got cameras. Two cameras. Yeah, you got here. two cameras. You got two cameras no here. Respect. But won't you shoot something useful we can show during the set with your two cameras? Nice. Thank you. Yeah. You're a little bit of a hater. Sorry. I don't think you are sorry. 